California. This is the 85th renewal of a rivalry that started way back in 1892. She's got Betty Davis on. So like Klaus von Bülow was accused of trying to kill his wife. They took off from airfields in southern Argentina. Total war that shocked the world with its use of chemical weapons. The Principality of Monaco has been in mourning since Princess Grace died on Tuesday. My fellow Americans, I'm pleased to tell you today that I've signed legislation that will outlaw Russia forever. We begin <laughs> bombing in five minutes. And over those 85 games, the point differential was 32 points. Well, this is some show, I'll tell you. And now, the Bears in a seemingly impossible situation. They have only one timeout left. They pretty well have to run it back to save the game. And boy, talk about a heartbreaking way to lose. Great way to win if you are a Stanford fan. Eight seconds to go, 35-yard kick by Harmon. It'll go right up there with Langford's kick in 74, which was further, of course, a 50-yarder at the buzzer. The officials meet with the head coach before every game. Mr. Moffitt came and says, uh, any trick plays or secret plays or like that that we should look for? I said, no, sir, but I would like to uh, share with you the prayer that the bullfighters uh, use before they go into the uh, arena and face the bulls. It's unlikely that Ford can get the ball and get Que Dios reparte la suerte. What a recovery by Stanford. You have to give them all sorts of credit. May God divide the luck. All right, here we go with the kickoff. Here's four seconds left on the clock. This is the final play. It's the final play of the game. It's the final play of the season. Harmon will probably try to squib it, and he does. Most amazing finish in college football. Ball comes loose, and the Bears have to get out of bounds. They had practiced this play. Rodgers along the sideline, another one. There's Einsteinian in terms of how it distorted time. God said, hmm, should I have an earthquake strike? They get it to Rogers. They give it back now to the 30. They're down to the 20. No, let's just send the band out. Oh, the band is out on the field. Truly unbelievable. He's going to go into the end zone. Nothing like this has ever happened. He's going into the end zone. Never going to happen again. Will it count? Are they going to call it back? The Bears have scored. Was it real? There were flags all over the place. Utter disbelief. In my heart, I was, I was truly, truly devastated. You have a dream, and the dream is suddenly just in a split second. Of, I mean, it's gone. And, and the, the dream may never come again, and hasn't. The Bears have won! The Bears have won! Oh my God! The most amazing, sensational, dramatic, heart-rending, Exciting, thrilling finish in the history of college football. California has won the big game. We just made college football history. But I have never, never seen anything like it in the history of I've ever seen any game in my life. The Bears have won it. There will be no extra point. This play. The play. The play. The play. With the play. The play. The play. It ranks right up there, if not at the top, of the great possibilities of sports and therefore of life, you know, that it can happen.